Research. Elsewhere on the ISU campus, researchers with the university have made a discovery about the potential causes of autism. Dr. Michael Thomas and his research team found that fish show autism-like gene expression after being exposed to water that contains psychoactive drugs. The study focused on anti-seizure drug, uh, um, that medication, carbamazepine, and anti-depression drugs like fluoxetine and venflaxine. And they were tested in concentrations that are similar to those found in our aquatic systems. Dr. Thomas says this raises the possibility that pregnant women who drink water with trace concentrations of the drugs could then pass them to the unborn child and that their research has brought about really more questions than answers here. It's like having a compass and it's pointing us in a new direction. You know, we haven't walked a step yet, or maybe we've walked a couple steps, but we're, we're starting to move in a new direction. We kind of have an idea, a new question, a new hypothesis, but we have a long ways to go before we, we're at, a, at the point where we can understand uh, human, actual human health implications. It's interesting. So if you'd like to read more uh, Dr. Thomas' study, you can find a link to it on our website with this story. It's at kpvi.com.